Whoa. Oh wait, hold on a second. This is in linear format. I don't want that. Hello, boys and girls. Linear format. Linear is like the opposite of super view. Oh, okay, so it's so narrow. it's so it's like a actual proper like focal length. But we're back at Daisy Hill. We're gonna hit the Nah. Dan's here. Hey. It's uh. So the bugs. Yes. <laughs> so we're gonna start moving soon. I'm back from injury. I broke this finger here. Uh, it's still a bit sore, but the doctor gave me the go ahead to ride. So that's a, what we're gonna do. There's some new stuff, isn't there? I don't know if it's even open yet. Oh well, we'll go have a look anyway. I think it's called Bee's Knees. Why have I still got my finger in shot? So we'll go do that and uh, some other stuff. So we'll get into it. Where did I put my gloves? Oh, that, it's fine. <laughs> No, put your freaking gloves on. <laughs> hey, I still broke my finger even though uh, I had them on. Oh, they're in my pocket. Okay. <laughs> nah, gloves are good for gravel rash and, you know, sticks and stuff. But if you hit a tree or a rock, they do nothing. I didn't think you had your gloves on that day. I did. I remember distinctly because I tried to uh, take them off and it was not very pleasant. First ride I've done for quite a few weeks. So take it easy on me, Dan. Got some Renos. Ooh, yeah, that, <laughs> that breaking finger's sore, but it's all part of the process of healing. Ooh, how do I ride bikes? <laughs> Down this way, I suppose. Normally they don't like you going through here. Oh yeah, that, that hurts the finger, but <laughs> just gotta get back into it. We're actually out on a uh, Friday for a change. Dan's got the week off, and I just work whenever I feel like it. Well, I mean, the, that's the half truth anyway. Oop, gotta start the ride. There we go. And you may have noticed already, but uh, things might be looking a bit crisper, a bit smoother, a bit noisier as well, because I didn't attach the media mod, but I am running the new GoPro Hero 11. That's the standard size one, not the mini, although from what I've read, they both output the same image. Ah, cheers. So apologies if this is a little bit uh, windy, noisy. I mean, Daisy Hill is known for its high octane speed. Open up. I can't, the dog's in the way. I may have added a few kilos to me, so everything's fitting a little bit tighter. Speaking of fit though, <laughs> not in the athletic sense, but in the fashion sense. 2022, 2023, I've signed on to be a ambassador for a rubber side down. Gone is the blue and white jersey, and now I've got a blue, white, and black jersey. <laughs> and I have to say, their kit, is so good and this isn't me trying to sell out or anything but it's genuinely breathable it's lightweight and it fits really well <laughs> and i think the biggest thing is it's all made in australia so get on to these guys they're they're awesome all right so what do you reckon dan will that get us to the new stuff though no all right well i'll do it anyway this is a uh, trail that I've done numerous times but don't normally go this direction. Oh. Cheers mate. Yeah, yeah, mate. The the... yeah that's why I'm giving away. Yeah, well, oh good man. To fall off. That's all good man neither can I. Right. <laughs> Cheers. That's your mate Dan. <laughs> well he'll soon see himself on uh on YouTube. This is fun. Oh, bit dusty, bit loose. But it feels good to be back on the bike. Oh, not quite. That's fun going down that. Yeah. 
Oh, there's the line. Don't know if that is the line, but Daisy Hill on a Friday morning. How good. Whew. Oh, we'll keep going to the end of this trail. Catch up with Dan there. He was telling me before that he's been off the bike for a few weeks and uh, he only just got back into the uh, weekly shop rides this week. And his legs were feeling it, dude. There we go. Follow you, Dan. <laughs> Running fast today. Oh, what's the line? <laughs> Yeah. Oh no. So what's this one we're going on to, Dan? Uh, bronze wing. Bronze wing. All right, lead the way, Dan. Give it a go. This is some more wonderful trail works. Trail goodness bit of rough stuff too bad you probably drop that boulder back there jump it This is great, I like this. This is like a chiller version of um, Flying Cloud. Way chiller. So if you're not quite there, give this one a whirl. Hell yeah. So continue on, Dan. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Brilliant. It's great that they both start and finish on fire roads. It means you've got options to how you want to run them. So smooth. Is this mountain biking? Some would argue not. Definitely feeling it in the lungs today. Anytime off the bike, it's hard to recover sometimes with the fitness. I was saying before the skill's still there, or what I had anyway. <laughs> but, oh yeah. The lungs are burning. I guess this is kind of like if you mixed uh, a bit of flying cloud with a bit of a uh, uh, lace monitor. Just a bit. You never knew there was so much vertical of Daisy. <laughs> there we are. That's so good. Woo! Have a breather here. Woo! All right, a little resty. I'm out of shape. <laughs> Whoa, look at how wide that super view is. I haven't actually seen it from the front here, but look at those chunky arms. By the way, not selling out. But if you are a bike manufacturer and you want someone to ride their bikes really, really poorly in 2023. Me. <laughs> watch Dan, <laughs> he says. Or I mean, you could, you could send us both bikes if you want. Look, I'm not gonna stop you. Marketing department, reach out to me. Come on, boys. Anyway, back into the riding. You wanna follow me in this time? All right, lap number two, bronze wing. Dan's following me through here. Give it a go. Did the sighting so we know what we're in for. Probably should have dropped my PSI a touch for these uh, dusty conditions. It's all right. 
actual display. So, <laughs> oh, this is fun. Well, very fun going fast through here. Just pump those bumps, hit the jumps. That's an interesting jump through there. You hit the rough stuff. It's a berm, another berm, tight section, have a hip if you're so inclined. <laughs> it's fun. Oh, that's, that's soft. That corner, that flat one. Whew. All right, that's the fast stuff. We'll make our way back to the first fire road break. It'll be interesting to see what the footage looks like and what the sound sounds like. I don't have wind noise reduction on because that sounds horrible <laughs> if you ask me. I usually have the, uh, as you would know, the media mod attached to the GoPros I use which has a bit of a wind foam and on the external microphone um, but didn't bring that today I actually planned to use uh, some external microphones but some very smart man decided not to charge them the night before <laughs> so here we are but um, right now what you're seeing is quite unique to the channel 60 frames per second 4k 10-bit HDR, baby. That's 420 10-bit, which is still pretty good. I mean, my professional gear that I use for work has a higher record rate. I think it's like 140 or 160 megabit per second. Whereas I think the GoPro might be 100, 120. The gear I have so there's 422, 10 bit, or is this only 420, but it should still be a really nice image, hopefully. Oh, it's getting warm. Right, eh? Down B's knees. Speedy run. My finger is feeling pretty good. I broke it back in uh, late August, so almost three months ago. And it was the day before the Rocky Trails uh, Mount Cotton round. I was out doing practice runs and yeah, <laughs> it wasn't even anything cool. I was climbing up Escalade and I just, my mind was wandering as it does. And I just went off the track and slam my finger between a, the brake lever and a tree at about 15k but that's all it needed Let's see if i can find some x-ray pics they look pretty interesting whoa that was interesting whoa. 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 Oh, it's loose. Oh, okay. Slow it down. We've only just got back on the bike. <laughs> I felt that, but I don't know if it came across on camera. <laughs> Ooh, loose. Loose, loose, loose. Classic daisy dust. On a trail that really probably needs a bit more bedding in. Although, it's not too bad. This is where it starts to get real soft. Just as you make your way down to the fire road. Like I was saying before, 
some rain should sort that out no problem and there we are that's it for today fun trails these ones um bees knees and i've forgotten the name of the other one bronze wing what did you think dan yeah good good trails is it better than flying cloud <sighs> no anyway what are we going to do we're going to go load a washing machine in maybe wash our bikes if dan's so kind enough and uh go get some lunch or brunch as the europeans call it i think we call it that too <laughs> anyway catch you boys and girls at the next one good to be back